pretty crazy two days. I don't know how I've ended up here, but for some reason I'm here. I was gonna do a two part series, but I wrapped it all up into one. So this is gonna be a bit of a banger for you guys. As you know, I took a trip down to Wales to go to a supercar show and we've got a little bit sidetracked, maybe even a little bit lost. And we're somewhere in the Welsh Valley. Uh, as you can tell, the views are insane. The visuals from up here are crazy. I recommend you guys, if you live in the UK, take a trip down to Wales and just drive, just explore, just see what you can find because this little gem here, I think we can probably see for like three, four hundred miles in that direction. I can see mountains, I can see lakes, I can see hills, and I, and I can see sheep as well because there's a lot of sheep in Wales. But this is crazy. And what better way to do it in the new AMG? This is the first time I took the car for a long distance drive, and I must say, well, you'll see how good it is. So let's cut to the video back on Friday night when we left to come to this beautiful country. Just before we get into today's video, guys, remember I'm doing a giveaway on my Instagram. I'm giving away them Jordan 4s in retro blue. You've only got about 300 more subscribers until I get there. It's growing very, very fast. And as I say, the giveaway will end as soon as I hit 27K subscribers. If you want to go for it, enter on my Instagram, link in the description. It's absolutely free. It's going to cost you nothing to enter. And yeah, you've got to be in it to win it, guys. But let's jump into today's video. If you like the content, make sure you subscribe and like. And yeah, hopefully see you guys back on the channel very soon. Hello guys and welcome back. It's your boy H8 and you're in for a treat. There's a car show on tomorrow, which is like Cars and Coffee, Cardiff. I've been invited down there, so thought I'd make a little appearance. You know me, getting out and being active. Taxi! Boy loves cars. Does he? Oh, I love it. Yeah, good. <laughs> V8. Yeah, mate. Yeah. Nice. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> Put the kids in the boat. Like it? <laughs> yeah. Cheers, mate. Uh, yeah, 120, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hello. They say you only put V power in this, but obviously we're an ultimate VP, so can't do that so I'm not going to fill it up all the way. There's actually a little sticker in the petrol cap that says choose shell V power unleaded. Do not put VP in it. All right, what do you want in the petrol station babe? You come in. Just come in guys. See you in a minute. We've just got under the two hour mark. I don't I don't actually know where we are. I think we're in Reading or something but this is the road we're on it for 80 miles and it takes us straight to the bridge which takes us into Wales so yeah, it's going to be a long one. We're going to try and stop for a bit of food because we haven't had any dinner yet. And we're both absolutely starving. Are you starving, babe? Yeah, but I've just stuffed my face with Yeah, she's just stuffed her face with Doritos and she's eating a Snickers. I'm trying to be sensible and not eat so I can enjoy my dinner, which is what normal people would do. Isn't that right, people? Yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> Bonus banquet. Yeah. That looks yeah. so jank. I hate KFC so much, but I'm so hungry. Needs must. It's one of them ones tonight. If, if I had an idea, I would have had a Nando's, but beggars can't be choosers. Did you bring your passport for Wales? How are you going to get into Wales without a passport? I'm running. You seriously didn't bring your passport? No. We're going to a different country. Guys, what's she going to do? She ain't going to be able to get in. <laughs> Whoa. Hours later. I've made it to Cardiff. What a journey. I am absolutely shattered. I don't know if you can hear, but I'll take you over. It is the first night that Cardiff or Wales is open and it is absolutely rammed out here. Right, there's just so many people floating about. I swear if I didn't have to drive around tomorrow, I would be out tonight partying, bro. That looks sick. I've been a proper C-U-N-T and parked over two spaces, but we don't want to damage that wrap. That is precious, that is precious. Got to look after this baby. So yeah, glistening. It's like the Hulk's car really, isn't it? Super excited for the car show tomorrow to see what other people have got. Can't wait to meet so many different people, get some new links. And yeah, it's gonna be a good weekend. So uh, let's get up to the hotel room. Made it into the room, all settled down. 
It's about one o'clock now, so oh, just sat on my bag. But I am gonna hit the sack, and I will see you guys in the morning. Peace out, guys. I am ready, and I am running late as per usual. So I need to grab all the camera stuff now, and then head out. But check out the view. That. Right over there, that little white bit. I think that's Cardiff City's football stadium. I think. I don't really know. Just chatting shit. But yeah, we gotta go. Apparently I didn't book breakfast. I think it's your fault. Apparently. I thought I did. I genuinely thought I did. <laughs> yeah, running so, so, so late. Should have been there. 10 minutes ago. I've got to wait for the car to cool down. And I had to eat, otherwise I'd have had Yeah, otherwise I'd have had... It was either I'd get there 10 minutes late and have a happy girlfriend, or get there 10 minutes early and have the most miserable person ever for the day. That's so exaggeration! That's so That's rude! That's not an exaggeration, that is exactly what Are you that. joking? Pray for me, guys. Yes, guys, so we made it. Drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Get up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Fit up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Right. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Tell everyone about the Indian birthday party going on. No, mate, DJ cancelled, but we've got that music, so it's alright. <laughs> Cars are sick though. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and a giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, So my first car show has been different. I think, uh, yeah, it was good, it was good. But I think it wasn't the atmosphere that maybe I thought it was gonna be. I think like D-Max would be better and different. So bring that on. Nice to uh, nice to get the whip out. People people love to see it, things you love to see. This car being one of them. I don't know if you've got to get in that lane. I have, but I'm gonna run one more time. Okay. Just, just so guys that wraps up today's footage it was a sick day i met some well cool people and actually got talking to a couple boys uh, and uh, found some good filming locations for tomorrow so we're gonna go and explore in the amg try and find some sick roads for some footage i'm just watching tv about to hit the sack as you can tell can't stop yawning i'll catch up with you guys in the morning and uh, yeah hopefully i'll get some sleep tonight we may have overslept a little bit and we've got to rush now and get all our stuff ready to go, so... Let's get it! Going just yet, we're gonna go and have a look around Cardiff City Centre, have a little explore before we go. Be rude not to. Lottie wants to have a look in Zara and that, so seems like that's what we're gonna do. And then we're off to find these roads in the Brecon Beacon National Park. But yeah, it should be decent.
What a day, what a day. Right, now we are just about to leave and get en route to the Brecon Beacons National Park, which will be the final destination of our Welsh holiday, because uh, we haven't had a holiday this summer, so this is the closest thing we've had. Isn't that right, babe? Uh -huh. Yeah, exactly. Ooh. Right, so I think we've got about an hour there. So uh, I'll see you guys when we're down there. Hopefully it lives up to the name. Hasn't really got a name, has it? Huh? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Cheers! Honestly, every road in this country is It's not straight. In the valley, I'm in the valley. Guys, the roads around here are beautiful. You just don't get nothing like this where I'm from. Mud. So we're lost in Wales now. The sat nav won't update and I have no idea where we are. We're running through a little town. I don't know what the town's called. Um, I can't read the signs because I see a different language as well, so not ideal. If my family see this and I'm, and I'm dead, then I loved you all and I'm somewhere in Wales lost. <laughs> Fingers crossed, I think we're going the right way now, so we, sh we shall soon, we shall soon, we shall, we shall soon see. Let me talk quick. So guys, one of the guys we met yesterday recommended that we drive through this road, it's kind of on the way home, and we have found it. We are in the middle of a place called Lamgear, Lamgear India, or something like that. Don't know, definitely don't quote me on the way I pronounced it, but it is insane. The visuals are insane. So what I'm going to do in a minute is cut to some visuals of me driving this road because they are lit. So three, two, one, let's go! Jesus guys, check out the view. So we've made it to the top of a mountain. Uh, 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 let me just check what mountain it's called. It's called Crickhow Mountain uh, in a place which I can't pronounce. Um, funny story, I've been parked here for 10 minutes and already had two people drive by and send me videos of the car, which is crazy. I'm in the middle of nowhere and people have obviously seen the channel. So I love it, I love to see things like that. But the views here are stunning. It's rain, not raining, raining, not raining. It wasn't even raining when we got here and now the floor is completely soaked. But this location here is where they film some of the top gear. So they drive all the supercars through the valleys up the hill like that, but they get obviously get the road shot. Obviously, I'm not that lucky to have the road to myself. But yeah, insane views. You can literally see rain there. You can see rain over there. It's, it's, it's only a matter of minutes till it rains enough. Yeah, this is uh, it's pretty surreal. It's been a bit of a, a funny weekend, but I've enjoyed it. It's been nice to get away. It's almost felt like the first holiday of the year, so it's banging. That is gonna be all for this little Cardiff trip. It's been about a thousand mile round trip, and uh, I'm gonna go, go and head home now, back to reality, back to work. You'll probably see this after my first drive video, which will be going up on Wednesday, and then this should be live on Sunday, guys. So yeah, decent. On that note, I'll see you guys in a bit. <laughs>